what do you guys think about the wrapping paper on the F80? Got the Christmas lights too. I'm almost done. Let me. I've been doing this for the last three days. Today, <clears throat> today I'm finally gonna be done. What's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Thanks for checking out another video. You guys already saw the title and the thumbnail. So today I am gonna be selling one of my cars. Unfortunately, only three model four BMW is not cheap. After two years of owning the E46, I already done drive this car. As you guys can see, it's all dirty. It just sits here. I did the F80 brake conversion. I did the matching roll cage. We got the sparkles. We have the big wing. I know a lot of people are not fans of the big wing. Bola exhaust. This is a really good car. I really wish I can keep them all, but I can't. RTD shifter custom steering wheel it thinks sounds ready good I got the Ridgeline GT3 front lip. This thing sounds good, guys. So I am selling the E46. Once I have the money from the E46, I'm gonna focus on the E92. So look out for more mods coming for the E92 bill. The fitment on this thing is perfect right now. It sits on the KWV2s, I believe. Man, the F80 brakes is, the F80 brakes look really, really good on this car. I'm gonna be putting it on the E92 as well. I'm going to miss this car guys. I really wish I can keep them all, but I can't. So yeah guys, I gotta let go of the E46. One last drive in the E46. One of the biggest reasons I'm selling the car is, um, it turns out having three cars right now really doesn't work out for my life. I have nowhere to park them. I only have like a two parking space. And since I bought the E92, it turns out I like the E92 a lot better. So it makes no sense to just have this um, park on the street. I feel bad because I already don't drive it that often. And I feel like the car should be driven. And um, yeah guys, that's one of the biggest reasons. I do enjoy making content, but I like to buy the car that I like and make content around it. But the E46 ready doesn't do good on YouTube either. So that's one of the reasons I have to let it go.
20 minutes later. Alright guys, story time. So the new owner of the E46 came sometime last weekend and test drove the car. He already liked it, he couldn't make up his mind. So I, I gave him an offer, he already couldn't refuse. So he came today, bought the car, super excited. Went around the block a couple more times, took off. 30, 30 minutes later, he called me, he said the car was making some weird noise, right? So I'm like, oh man, that sucks. Not what I expected, brought the car back. Wasn't too far from my house. Did some investigation, I guess he got too excited. Took off, snapped the differential side bolt. I can't make this shit up, man. So now he has a decision to make. Am I responsible for this? Let me know what you guys think. I just set up my camera. This is what the F80 looks like right now. We're about to go shoot some rotors for IG. I'm not sure if the paper is gonna stay on, but we're gonna see what happened. I know usually everybody just do the lights. I wanted to switch it up a little and be different. So I went with the wrapping paper as well. I'm pretty sure it's gonna look sick when we roll it. I probably could go crazier with the lights, but should be cool for now. You say you a strategy. I'm gonna need you by my side, yeah. I've been living on the edge, just trying to get it together. Tell me, yeah. can you hold me down? Tell me, can you hold me down? All right, guys, we made it out to Long Beach. Found a really dope spot. The rap did survive on the freeway. The hood did get a little bit messed up. We came to Long Beach. I took some dope photos. Make sure you follow me on IG if you want to see the photos. Once again, thanks for rocking with your boy. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.